I, I don't get it. What don't you get about it? I, I don't get why we need another Terminator. I just, I, I don't, I don't get I'm it. I'm gonna fucking kick your fucking ass. <laughs> you don't please, shut please up don't for a me. second, Please right? don't hurt me, Mr. Bale. I'm gonna go, do you want me to go fucking trash your lights? No. Do you want me to fucking trash them? No, I don't want you to trash them. <laughs> Hey, what's up guys? I'm back here for another reaction video. Today we're going to watch the Terminator Dark Fate trailer. It just dropped this morning and yeah, Terminator's back, man. It's like this series that just refuses to die. Um, this is the sixth Terminator movie and I feel like most people agree that the first two are good and then most people don't like the other sequels. So, um... It's crazy that this keeps going. Like X-Men, I feel like this franchise, I don't really care about it that much anymore because the continuity's gotten so messed up and there's different actors and it's not even the same thing anymore. The funny thing about the Terminator movies is that like with each sequel, it makes the previous movie look better. So like the third one came out and people were like, nah, it wasn't as good as the first two. But then the fourth one came out and like, well, three wasn't that bad. And then five came out and they're like, oh, four wasn't that bad. So um, we'll see how this one is. But I really, you know, I enjoyed the first two Terminator movies. It's iconic films. And I like the third one, even though it's kind of campy. The fourth one has grown on me over the years. And even the fifth one has a lot of great moments. Um, the, the older Terminator, Arnold character was um, actually really enjoyable for me in the fifth one, even though I didn't really care for um, like rebooting the franchise. It was like a weird, they call it a soft reboot, I think. It, like it was and it wasn't. I don't even know anymore. So we're gonna go ahead and check out the trailer for the sixth movie. Uh, this one has Linda Hamilton coming back and Schwarzenegger. And I don't know if this one has James Cameron's blessing, but I feel like the last two did also, so we'll see if that means anything. All right, here we go. Terminator, Dark Fate, and go. Two days ago, I had this nice, sinful life. And now it's a nightmare. Very Fast and Furious vibes going on here. Oh! Oh, that's the guy from uh, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Oh, that's cool. Who are you? So we got a Terminator versus Terminator, and My Grandma's the most Connor. powerful. Never seen one like you before. Almost human. Second, fourth movie. I am human. And a TV show, right? I never saw a TV show. Oh yeah, Tim, Mo uh, Tim Miller. Because I was her. There he is. Grandpa. Oh. <laughs> I didn't even see she's hanging now from we win. We win by keeping you alive. <laughs> Okay. Well, there it is. All right, well, that was the trailer for Terminator th 3. <laughs> 6, 3. 
All right, well, that was the trailer for Terminator Dark Fate uh, with Linda Hamilton and Arnold Schwarzenegger back, although it doesn't really seem like Schwarzenegger's in it much. I wonder if that's just the trailer. Um, looks like it's a lot more about Mackenzie Davis, who's our new, like, human hybrid Terminator, but, you know, they kind of did that with Sam Witwer in the fourth film, so I wonder what's going to be different about her. Uh, Gabriel Luna, he played Ghost Rider on the fourth season of Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. And he's very good, so if he's the bad Terminator in this, that's, I'm cool with that. Um, it kind of looked like they were going for a more contemporary Terminator model, kind of like the fifth film with uh, the John Connor Terminator, uh, kind of mixed with the old school look, and that was kind of cool. Uh, there, there's cool effects in there, but none of the set pieces really stood out to me that much. Um, I don't feel very hyped for it, to be honest with you. It just kind of seemed run-of-the-mill. I didn't really get much of a sense of story either. There's not, like, like is John Connor going to be a part of this? Where does this take place? I'm on the Wikipedia right now. It says that it's a two decades after Terminator 2, assuming then that it ignores the other films, which is just great. I mean... <laughs> It's not great. It's so stupid. Do a reboot already. It's so confusing. This is uh, Tim Miller who directed Deadpool. The whole these timelines are so confusing gag. That's exactly what this is. So like I said, like I do like the first two Terminators. I like three and four and parts of five, um, but I'm not a Terminator fan. Maybe this will be a lot more appealing to Terminator fans. Um, but yeah, like I said, it just nothing in this really stood out to me. Maybe I have to watch it again, but um, you know. Tell me what you think of this trailer in the comments and uh, let me know which Terminator movie is your favorite and why. So, uh, yeah, until next time, guys, take it easy. Fuck's sake, man, you're amateur. I don't know that word.